All right, guys, quick update. Couldn't really do the time lapse of unboxing the boxes. We're in the process of moving, so um, don't really have too much space. So we have five seats, four deep, one standard. Stealth tech, left and right, two deep backs, two standard backs, and another standard back back there. I'm gonna have my pillows fluffing for a couple hours before I put them in the, sh in the covers, covers, covers. Have my assistant. And um, yeah, I'm gonna keep you guys posted on what's going on. All right guys, so um, we have the subwoofer installed. Has four thumb screws, one here, one there, one here, one there. These, mount these brackets, they click on, and then you put the screws on four and then you use the pegs to screw them on this is on the bottom of your regular uh seat this is not a deep this is not a uh, a storage seat this is a regular seat before you do this you want to make sure your sound bar is connected and ready to go because you will need to pair the sound bar with the control unit because you don't want to flip it over and then have to redo it again. So um, make sure your red wire is for the right and your white wire is for the left, which is right over there. Um, this is basically when you're sitting down, the right would be on your right side and the right would be on your left side, if you understand what I'm saying. And um, I'll keep you updated. All right, guys. So this is what it should look like after. When you flip it, make sure you keep your wires neat. All right, cool. We'll be back. All right, guys. Everything is in. When you guys um purchase, make sure they give you a map where all your shoes are going to go. Makes it a lot easier. And not for nothing, it does take a little bit of force. So don't be scared to um push on it hard. Pause. All right, guys, so this is the finished product. We have five seats, seven sides, Stealth Tech on this side and on that side, subwoofer in the middle, soundbar is mounted, TV is mounted, still missing some picture frames, and uh, we added some blankets to make it feel more homey. And um, yeah, this is the Love Soft material. Really happy with it. It's extremely comfortable. And um, I think it looks great. All right, guys. So this is the app. It's the dashboard. You configure your basically your your couch, your configuration, um, custom profiles. This is the main screen. You can adjust the volumes on all your different things. And um, it has a bunch of different modes. Each mode uh, puts the sound out different. So I'm gonna give you guys a little test run so you guys can hear it. I have it on movie right now. We have Aquaman on. I'm gonna put it on. <laughs> destined for each other. So basically you have a whole bunch of different um settings you guys will play with it yourself so you can see um again there's a speaker here and here each of the different profiles basically uh puts the sound out in different areas it is very loud like i told you guys so um keep this in mind 
And um, like I said, I love it. Uh, you have to be in a, in a place where you can actually, you know, play this at a reasonable sound. I usually keep it like right here. I don't have it all the way like this. Kind of reasonable, you know. Put it on a movie. And yeah, man, this is it. I was gonna make you some eggs. Quiet couch mode. Quiets the couch, obviously. And then mute. Fades it all. So this is it guys, this is the Stealth Tech sound. Let me give it to you guys one more time so you can hear it. Make it better. Let me fast forward to a part where there's more drama. Let's see. You will be vibrating. Oh yeah, this is the Stealth Tech remote. You can also do the same thing that I'm doing on the phone here. It's a little easier on the remote though, I feel. Quiet couch. Listening to music on this sounds really nice. Um, if you're having a party, it would be awesome. Whatever you need it for, this thing is amazing. It's literally having a movie theater in your house, literally. All right, so um, I broke this down to four parts. Price, comfort, customer service, and uh, stealth tech. I purchased my couch on 9 2022 it was before the Labor Day sale, so I got a 15% Stack More Save More. Excuse me. And a 5% on um, Heroes Code. It came out to $10,885 with uh, a discount of $2,177. Total of $9,284. I put a $3,000 down payment. And um, my, bills were, my bill was around $132 a month. Um... This couch went on sale about 10 days after, so I was able to price adjust my original payment. And I was able to get a 25% off Stack More Save More and 5% uh, off for the Heroes. And I also was able to get a 5% abandoned cart uh, code. So um, it brought it down from 9284 to about $8,000 what I paid for this in total. Minus the 3000 came out to about 5000 in total. Um, for 48 months, so I ended up paying about $104, $105, rough estimate for the whole couch a month for 48 months. It was supposed to be 24 months, but um, the showroom didn't advise me of this, so I was on the phone with customer service, and they honored the 48 months for me. Um, customer service uh, and showroom, they don't have, they're not on the same page, so you have to make sure you get everything with customer service, because at the end of the day, they're the one who's gonna deal with your price and they're gonna ones who are gonna deal with the synchrony bank and they're the ones who you're gonna be dealing with when it comes to payment. Um, comfort, I got the Love Soft. It is very comfortable. I would say it's almost like a bed. Um, some people worry about getting the Love Soft because over time they're thinking it's gonna wear out or you know, they just feel like it's too soft. It's, you know, personal preference. I went Love Soft. Because, you know, I want it to be as comfortable as possible. I spend a lot of time in my living room. And I want to be happy with it. And I am happy with it. Um, what I recommend is if you sit in the same seat all the time, maybe switch seats with the cushions. And, you know, make sure you always fluff your couch and, um, you know, that kind of stuff. Stealth Tech. The Stealth Tech is amazing. It's a home theater in your house. I'm going to make another clip where I show you guys how it sounds. A um, couple things you got to keep in mind. If you have neighbors, if you live on top of somebody, if you have kids, um, you know, it is very, very loud. So you want to be able to understand that if you don't have the space where you could, you know, play this as loud as you want or, you know, however you want to play it, it's going to, you know, it might change your, you know, idea of whether you want to purchase it or not. For me, 
I went to the showroom and I heard it, I had to have it. It's just, it was necessary for me. The couch wasn't the same without it. So I purchased it and I'm very happy with it, whether you know I have to turn it down or not. I'll show you guys another clip of how you can actually control um, the settings. There's an app. It's not all that. It's very glitchy, but I'm sure it'll get better. Um, Stealth Tech was pretty easy to put together. In the clip I show you, um, I did have to take it apart a couple of times to move the rug, um, to repair it after I put the soundbar on the wall. But overall, it was very easy to put together and I would recommend it if you can have it in your house. Um, yeah, I am very happy with my couch. It is a very nice uh, improvement in my atmosphere and I really like it. Uh, I would recommend Love Soft uh, Phil, in my opinion, because it's the most comfort. And, uh, you know, again, it's a personal preference. And, um, yeah, this is my first YouTube video. Hope you guys liked it. You know, definitely got some work to do on my YouTube videos. But uh hope you guys enjoyed it. And I got a couple more clips for you guys to see what it actually sounds like. And, um... Hopefully it helps you in your purchase. If you have any questions, you could always uh, message me or comment and I'll gladly respond to you guys. Peace.